Jacob Camborian has lived just about everywhere. I've been all over, kind of a gypsy. I grew up in New Hampshire. I moved to Colorado. I went back to New York to school. Yankees up! Yankees up! I lived in Massachusetts. <laughs> now I'm in Rhode Island. And no matter where he's had a slice, to him, there's nothing quite like Brooklyn-style pizza. So Brooklyn pizza is a style of pizza. Basically, they are making pizza with a thin, flaky crust, nice sauce. It's not too sweet, not too salty. We use a blend of low moisture and high moisture mozzarella cheeses. That is really New York style pizza, Brooklyn style pizza. So he decided to bring a taste of the Big Apple to Little Roadie at Napolitano's Brooklyn Pizza. With locations in Cranston and this one on Federal Hill in Providence, Napolitano's Brooklyn Pizza is a casual pizza parlor serving New York-style pizza by the slice. Owner Jacob Camborian and head chef Bobby DeRezzo are two guys passionate about pie, always on display stretching, throwing, saucing, and topping pizza perfection. It's a dinner and a show. People love to see us tossing the dough, putting it into the oven, taking it out. They love to see us working right where the food is coming out. So we add that level of interactivity with the customer and they like it. And many times when I'm making pizza, I see, I could feel the eyes upon me <laughs> when I'm working. You know, it's fun. And what they're making is magic with everything from a meat lovers loaded up with prosciutto, salami, and pepperoni to the Verrazano topped with fried buffalo chicken and blue cheese to something called the skinny malink. The skinny malink is our hickory smoked bacon with homemade candied jalapenos. You get the tanginess from the candied jalapenos and then you get a nice hickory smoked flavor from the bacon and it just brings it out so nicely in the pizza. It's delicious. It's a little bit of everything you want. It's a little sweet, it's a little salty, it's got a little spice to it from the jalapeno and it's just, it's a very, very flavorful pizza. There's also the Boardwalk, a white pizza topped with artichokes, broccoli and roasted garlic. And if you're looking for a bargain, just get the special, two slices and a soda for six bucks. It's quick and easy and it's everything you want when you come to a pizza place. It's just, I want a slice of pizza when I come in, but I want a deal and I want something that's gonna fill me up and it's exactly what it does. Napolitano's offers other pizza parlor favorites like stromboli stuffed with meats and cheese and crave-worthy calzones, except here they go over the top and deep fry it. So the deep fry calzone is basically mozzarella gatto with prosciutto. And then instead of baking in the oven, we throw it in the deep fryer and it comes out nice and golden on the outside. And then it's just nice and soft and like mozzarella and cheesy in the inside. It's not your typical calzone. A lot of people aren't expecting that you have a deep fry calzone. They're very confused. They ask about it and then you give it to them and they're like, they're in love with it and they get it all the time. And then they're like, oh, I want that deep fry calzone. I want the deep fry calzone. It's just, it's delicious. It's out of this world. And then there's the addictive garlic knots. We basically take pizza dough, cut it into strips, we tie it in a knot, and then we bake them in the oven with a little oil, put them in a pan with chopped garlic, a little garlic oil, a little parsley, and mix that around, and we serve it with a side of gravy. They're delicious. Other Italian eats include big plates of chicken parm served over pasta and some of the best meatballs on the hill. I don't really go anywhere else to get meatballs. It reminds me of like when your grandmother or your, your father cooked meatballs when you were younger. It's that like very authentic New York style of cooking. And for something simple with a silly name, order the Uli Uli's. So Uli Uli is spaghetti with garlic oil, parsley, a little crushed red pepper. People really like the flavor. I mean, what's better than fresh spaghetti? with garlic oil and a little crushed red pepper and parsley, a little side of Parmesan cheese. Nice, satisfying dish. And if you can fit anything else in your belly, the Nutella stuffed fried dough is the way to go. We cut the dough into squares and then they puff up in the fryer later and then we make our homemade Nutella sauce that we literally inject into the middle of the dough and then we top it with the cinnamon sugar. It is absolutely delicious. The whole place smells like, mmm, the aromas. And whether you grab one to go or take in dinner with that pizza making show for a slice of Brooklyn, there's no place like Napolitano's. Mm -hmm.